I'm Jim Carter with your WCCM News Talk video headlines for this Wednesday, July 25th. Haverhill Mayor James Ferentini says the shooting death of two young men and the wounding of two more at 631 River Street in Haverhill on Monday night has, quote, shattered a quiet and peaceful city, close quote. Police are searching for the suspects in that Monday night shooting. The investigation is now in the hands of the Essex County District Attorney's Office. The city of Lowell has hired an automotive forensics investigator to determine what caused Engine 11 to catch on fire in the Lawrence Street Firehouse on July 12th. Lawrence City Councilors last night approved a plan to spend up to $15 million to upgrade a system that treats and distributes 7 million gallons of Merrimack River water daily. New Hampshire Democratic gubernatorial candidate Maggie Hassan told a crowd of about 60 people last night that New Hampshire's economy needs a boost provided by the legalization of expanded gambling and that she supports a casino at Rockingham Park in Salem. The Haverhill City Council told residents and business owners last night that they intend to fight the state's plan to turn South Central Street in Bradford Square into a one-way street. A fire at John's on the Oceanfront Hotel in Hampton Beach forced several guests out of their rooms yesterday morning. No injuries were reported. Last night in Lowell, city councilors directed harsh criticism at the Lowell License Commission for failing to take action last week on new rules for the city's liquor licensees after close to six months of efforts crafted to update regulations designed to quell violence in the downtown. And former President Bill Clinton's in Massachusetts. They'll be honored tonight with the first ever Global Environmental Leadership Award by the Walden Woods Project. It's taking place at the Boston Park Plaza Hotel. These are the stories that made news headlines on this Wednesday, July 25th, 1110 AM WCCM and 102.9 FM HD2, local news first. And if you're out and about, you can find us on your smartphone or tablet with the app TuneIn. For Bruce Arnold and Lou Blassie, I'm Jim Carter. Thank you for viewing our video news talk headlines.